Hey lads, my name is Skytron. Welcome to Year of You. Everything that has been going on, 40k special, I guess, uh, in a way, Year of You, all together in one video. We have a lot of things to talk, we have a lot of things to tell, and a lot of things to cover on this video. Um, let's quickly start, I guess, from the most noticeable thing on the channel, 40k goal. We did it! We reached our goal, 40,000. Thank you so much, lads. Genuinely, I don't know how to think. I thank you on every single one of the video at the end. But a lot of you probably click off. I'm pretty sure that 80% of you click off the video and before me saying thank you or like giving my own opinion when the uh, screen removes, animation is done, right? A lot of people just go away and like uh, they don't hear my messages, my opinions, and like when I say thank you. So I want to quickly say right now to the people who are not clicked off. Thank you so very much for supporting my channel over the years. Last year, 2017, 2018, and this year, 2019. Uh, at the beginning of the year, we had 25,000, I remember. Now we're at 40, which is absolutely crazy. And I remember, I remember putting a super high goal, uh, like a New Year resolution, but it was in January this year, and I said, Let's hit 50,000 and I'm like, bro, chill out. In in May or in like April, I said to myself, bro, we're not gonna get it. We're not even close. We're not even at 30K already. And I'm like, okay, no, 45 will be nice. Okay, September approaches, October, November approaches. I'm like, no, 40 would be a key. Uh, and you know what's crazy about it is that YouTube freaking glitched out, dude. Like five days ago, People start spamming me, congratulations Skycho, congratulations, oh we did it lads, the community. And I was so angry because like, no lads, do not, because in my phone and on YouTube Studio, it showed 39,000, 739,000 like, and I kept losing subs every day for what, 200, next night, 100, next night, 200, and it dropped to 39,600. So I checked, and it showed that YouTube was having issues with over a thousand creators on YouTube. A lot of people having the same issue with losing subs overnight. A lot of it. And they were trying to fix over four days. And they fixed it only today morning. I woke up and we have 40,200. That is crazy, lads. 200 more. We're kind of late to the party. We really are late to the party, lads. But again... Thank you so much for helping. I don't know what I should record. I don't know what I, what special things I should do for this video. Giveaway? I don't know. If you want giveaway, leave a comment, I guess. I don't know what I should do. Um, it's just pretty crazy to think. I mean, to me, this channel is everything. It's like my plan B in life. However, what I don't like in 2020 or what do I try to will try to avoid the best is copper i'm i was even thinking hey maybe next year my channel will be deleted not by me by copper and by ftc that's what i'm scared of losing my channel losing my two and a half year two two years and ten months of hard work for nothing that's gonna be painful <laughs> so that's the most anticipating and the most feared thing i'm uh uh, I'm looking for, I guess, I'm just, this is the most fearful thing uh, for 2020, next year, is COP and FTC. Uh, yeah, I don't have that much money to pay the 42,000 fee. But at the end of the day, we did it, another milestone. Uh, however, the for the first time in two and a half years, I'm not setting up a new goal. I know that setting up a goal really demotivates you. Uh, if you have put up a goal, for example, a sub count, right? It really demotivates you because you don't, you're not reaching it. You're not even close to it. So next year, I'm just gonna do my thing. Uh, I'm gonna gonna keep reacting as soon as I have the ability to do so. Uh, I'll keep on reacting to FNAF, to Bendy, uh, to a lot of games as well. Hopefully, Delta in Chapter Two is gonna come out, and. <laughs> a lot of memes this year, huh? Isn't it? A lot of memes happened. Uh, also, this year was full of SMG4, actually. Quite a lot. Every week <laughs> of the year. 
Metro Honor came out. This was a huge blast for the channel as well. It helped the channel as well. And in general, it was a bit best series of this channel. Like, if I had to nominate an animation of this year, non FNAF related. Non FNAF related. Hear me out. Non FNAF related. It is Metro Honor. Meta Runner is officially number one series on the channel for this year. If not FNAF related, again, it's a different topic FNAF. <laughs> Special Strike happened by the hottest dog, if you want to know about that. That's a huge thing as well. <laughs> uh, I guess the Special Strike was the biggest thing, it was the biggest hit for this year. In FNAF world, I guess. FNAF universe. Um, but yeah, next year I don't have any goals. I'm not gonna set up any goals. I I, I hope for at least 50,000. That's the bare minimum. If I'm not gonna give it that, then the channel's dead pretty much. Uh, so surpass 50,000 is definitely out there, but that's the minimal. <laughs> if we're not gonna get, it's like, why am I here? Why just to suffer? <laughs> uh, but in general, pretty interesting. Pretty interesting things happened this year. I started cooking videos. I remember, yeah. I started making Skytra Cook series, so that happened. Uh, it's a sh it's a videos. It's it's like, like videos how I cook stuff in a very simplistic way, but it tastes so delicious and it tastes good ex exactly how it is. And I made I think five or four episodes so far. Four I think four or five episodes of Skytra Cooks. There is a playlist on the channel. Check it out. A very interesting series I started on this channel. And also, another series I started was uh, uh, Five Nights of Very Short Animations. So I, I collect a lot of short animations from a lot of animators, and I put them in a one to one video, right? And I react to them. It's like FNAF Short, FNAF SFM Short. So that's a series. And there's, I think, three or four parts as well. I need to do more of them, actually. I definitely need to make more of FNAF SFM Short next year. I'm gonna keep on doing those. Maybe try not to have challenges. Who knows? But I did. One series that I tried to attempt doing was Try Not To Laugh Challenge this year. And it... Poof! It completely got... Not lack of support. The support for that series was zero. I said, no. I will never do Try Not To Laugh Challenge in my life. Because it's a completely fail and time loss. People don't watch this at all. Even, even like, four days ago, I made a daily dose of internet video, like, best of the internet 119, 200 views. The day before this video, FNAF SM drawn to the bitter, 5 point, even 6,000 views. I'm like, it's like this, compared to this. This tiny thing can crush it. Easy. So I'm gonna stick to FNAF. If that's the thing that people want, I'm gonna do that. Uh, I have to pay my rent <laughs> somehow, right? Um, I'm pretty happy to what we achieved this year, actually. I'm not gonna lie, like... A, a part of my life and a part of my years was spent on YouTube. And, like, putting everyday reaction is interesting. And I learned a lot about YouTube, a lot about the world, actually, overall. And improved my English skills compared to 2017. I remember back in 2017 at the beginning of the first videos, I couldn't even build up a proper sentence. Like I was struggling to build up a proper sentence. Right now I'm just automatically manually just printing up the words out there, not even thinking about it a second. And just pretty happy that I'm in this position right now. I have the audience, I have a community build up. Um, I'm not gonna give up anytime soon even though this year was full of depression i think we, we made two songs sky true suicidal and sky true alone i made the songs attempted to make songs i was proud of the first one second one i was happy about it but the support for that is zero and maybe a lot of you haven't even heard about the sky true alone song overall and i made two songs original songs myself and it took me one month of this year to make these two songs and this was the time when i was depressed i remember so from january till let's just say until august i was okay but like september it started starting to decrease and october i was completely like at the beginning of october i collapsed i got a huge depression attack and i was depressed for until november 
so September, October, November, three months of this year, three and a half, let's just say. I was depressed, I didn't have the motivation to make videos, I had to just force them, force reactions. Um, however, SMG4 was a funny thing, I really had a genuine th feeling for SMG4 because they are really funny and really making you laugh out there. Very interesting, very cool and stuff like that. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen next year, all I, I can predict right now is that next summer uh, I won't be able to meet my parents again, it's gonna be the third year I haven't seen my parents, hopefully by February I get my documents and I can hopefully finish my university first semester and without any retakes I can go to my parents, that'll be good. I don't know, the probability is... 30 to 70. 30% I will go, 70% I'll stay here alone. Um, on summer I'm gonna be working, so I don't know how it's gonna affect the videos. Probably I'll put, I'll try to come up with the most convenient time to be able. I'll probably work a very early morning until like 2 or 3 o'clock and I'll be able to come and make videos easily, so that's not a big problem. So yeah, I'm just... If, you, if I had to summarize overall year in a mood level, like a good year, bad year, like overall, I'd say January, February, March, until January, up until May, was a year of st stability. I wasn't happy, no, I wasn't sad, I was slightly above normal, I was like, ah, fine, I'm fine, I'll keep on doing this. But, I guess starting from July, August, I was sad, but I still I was still making videos. But then four months I was depressed, and overall if you count it down, if I had to count out all mixed together everything, the entire year was sorta of okay. It was, it was so-so, that's the word right there, so-so. So it's like, ah. Uh, not bad, overall not bad, like 3, 3 out of 5, um, not the best, not good, not even normal, but overall the year was so-so, uh, I'm still alive though, <laughs> nothing happened, I didn't kill myself, uh, I was thinking about it, but I'm fine, I'm, right now I am normal, I'm happy a bit, uh, it's sad that I'm celebrating Christmas and New Year alone. That sucks. And yeah, I do, uh, right now I'm, I'm I look at the videos I make. Glitch Tale was a good th two episode of Glitch Tale this year came out. That was a good thing. FNAF, 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 FNAF <laughs> SMG4, FNAF. Um, I played Subnautica below zero. This was a good thing. Started drinking G Fuel. I actually have to con continue doing it. Pretty good thing. Uh, April Joker came out. That was a good thing as well. Um, ah, yeah, I think this year, starting from this year, I started. I started to react to something series from. Oh my god, I remember. Oh my god, Jeremy, Jeremy, yeah, Terminal Montage. I started react to Terminal Montage, Jeremy, uh, to his something series. That was apps. I love that series. He's an amazing thing, and. Funny thing is, as well, is that two years we had 30k in April, and just about the end of the year, like two days left, we had 40k. We got it like five days ago, I think, four or five days ago. So, but still, imagine hitting 40,000 just by the same week as the year ends. That's insane, dude. So tight. It's so close, dude. We we made it. We made it. Um. One of the things as well I'm proud of this year is the Dalko green screen compilation. Um, so Dalko announced this year also a green screen, right? And he actually re reviewed that on his channel and he absolutely loved the way I made. I consider this as my first animation, I'm not sure. I will leave the links to that as well. To the very, I'll just leave to the very different types of stuff in the, in the description what happened and overall what I'm talking about. But yeah. 
uh, some ah I've announced Patreon this year, dude. There was no point in spending two days figuring out how it works, and yet nobody supported. <laughs> nobody supported Patreon. I don't know why I made it in the first place and put it on the very every single one of my videos. But yeah, new benefits, new possibilities, which is still true. You get to know more much about the projects and stuff. I mean, if there's me one support, I will publish the stuff. But if there's none, what's the point in wasting time? Uh, misfortune, little misfortune happened. Ah, uh, that was a good thing. A good game. Recently, we played it. Uh, reaction compilation. That's a good react. I really love the compilation. Uh, five. It's mostly FNAF year. I guess we can call it a FNAF year. The entire year was filled with FNAF content. Uh, I played Minecraft this <laughs> Yes, dude. We played Minecraft this year, I remember. I love the game. I, I remember I always hated the game so much. But you know what actually happened? I forced myself and was pressured by PewDiePie. Well, I've been watching his series. And the more I watched his YouTube, I was like, dude, this is fun. I downloaded it, I played two hours, and it absolutely changed my view of the game. I start playing more, more, and even publishing the video. But the sad part is, again, lack of support. Um, for that series, for Minecraft series, uh, I could have continued up until today, even Minecraft. I would have been making like probably la like two days ago, oh, Sky True Minecraft Part 4. 65. I would. I will still keep on going if there is support for that. I would definitely be going for that. But as more episodes come on, like comes out, comes out, and they're like, boom, poof. Uh, not much, but a pretty not bad year. Birthday. I celebrate birthday alone. I'm just quickly scrolling up to see what, how how the year was spent. And here is my most disliked video. I made a video about World of Warcraft Classic. I think at August, four months ago, they announced this game. I've... I remember! I started a Twitch channel this year, dude! I forgot about it. I started a Twitch channel this year, lads. I opened the Twitch channel, I created. And so far, we got 75 followers. That is amazing, dude. I've been streaming World of Warcraft, I remember it. About like two or three weeks? Ah, dude, that's a big chunk of a year as well. I played on my channel and a lot of you don't know this because barely anyone was watching me there, but I was streaming, I'm streaming rarely, but I will still, I will stream in 2020, stay tuned. I will definitely be streaming in 2020. Despite the fact that zero people are watching. I remember there was zero people and I've been streaming. And I was like, for who am I streaming? <laughs> Nobody. FNAF again, FNAF, 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 SMG4. How to cook? I'm still happy about it. So happy. Uh, and here's October, yeah. And you know what happened? I, re I, I think I returned with the song of Suicidal, yeah. I returned with the song. This guy just... It took me so much time. And it's so expensive as well to buy the blood and stuff. This guy, a little over three weeks ago and I published another song. Sky True Alone, dude. Please watch it. You have to watch it. If you really are a genuine fan, Sky True Alone is for you. Like a song by myself. I spent so much time on this. This was very difficult. And then Copper hit. Oh my god. Ah, oh, two months ago I announced a new song. I will publish a new song. The lyrics are ready. The beat is ready. I could have published it in December, I would make it, but I lost the motivation to make a song, new, the third song, Sky True Lone Life or like Life, I'm not sure yet, yet to what, to, what I should not name it, but it's gonna be something with life. Uh, Glitch Tale part episode 7, one month ago, Glitch Tale came out, episode 7 hit so fast, and a little over 4 weeks ago. The channel hit 10 million views, dude. As I said, like, look, I told you, last two months was the banger. Like, even one and a half months. 
Every day something new, new, new. I got a Dakimakura. Boom, I got VR. Boom. Dude. Especially, especially at the end, especially in like mid November and then December was the month, these two months were absolutely poof. Had so much stuff to do. I prom. I. Ah, oh, yes, lads. I did a stream, a very huge stream for four hours. I played Little Misfortune. Check that out. That is also amazing. Dude, crazy. Um, and here we go. A week ago, Moki's show. And then yesterday, literally yesterday, Moki's show. Harry Potter came out. Like, I mean, The Fury of Dumbledore. And this is the last YTP by Jay Clayton. Super laughable video. Christmas stream again. About, about like two, about a week again. I mean, not even two weeks have passed and I made a Christmas stream with you lads. Uh, for three hours. Four days ago, actually. Check it out. It was like five or four days ago. Wow. Insane as well, Christmas. Drawn to the bitter daily dose. Ah, uh, yeah, here's the thing. Uh, I was debating as well with a lot of the people in the community. Hey, it's only a FNAF channel now. People don't care about other videos. True. It's true. I Right now, I see the best of the internet on my channel. 247 views. Boom. The next video, or the video before it. FNAF has been drawn to the bitter. 6.4 thousand views. Dude, I've spent more time on this daily dose than the drawn to the bitter. And I got like, this is, this is the, the best of the entrance video. This is drawn to the bitter. Boom. Out of existence. I'm going to make FNAF next year. I'll continue because it gets more views. <laughs> and yeah. Five Nights Freddy's Stay Calm was a good one. YouTube Rewind last last night I uploaded. I don't know. Um, I'm, I don't have any goals. I don't have any goals for next year. But I hope I'll be able to... I'll have enough support. I'll have enough... Um, my, like, my mental state to keep on reacting. Because YouTube, making videos on YouTube means a lot to me. Uh, it's part of my life, and I cannot imagine YouTube. When I cannot imagine YouTube being out of my life anymore. Like I have to make videos every day because it's something that I love to do. Uh, I'm very scared because Coppa might delete my channel. There's a high possibility, and if that happens, then just losing all of this is really gonna leave a huge scar in my entire life. I will remember this, I will know about this, and if I receive two copyright strikes by COPPA or FTC, I'm gonna try the, my best to secure or download every single one of the videos and hopefully find a platform that I can re-upload all of this because losing the stuff that I made right now is just so scary just to think like so many years and so much effort. Wow, that was my stomach. <laughs> um, it's just like, I love doing this and especially love to see your feedback. I want to build a community even stronger. I want to keep on doing this because I love it. And hopefully there will be support. Hopefully, as lo I mean, Without you, you might think that you're just one person, right? But you can influence and you can do so much by commenting or just watching the video. And I don't know how many video, how many people made to this point of the video. Like how many people would actually watch me to the like 24 minutes of me talking right now. I'm pretty sure not much. Well, maybe even a, not even a hundred, but. I just want to quickly tell that I'm very thankful for what I have right now and thankful that you still watch me. Uh, just, I can't fathom the fact that 40,000 people, dude, like, yes, I may not get 40,000 views in one day. I may not get 40,000 on the last week video, in the days, but they did press the button, right? It's not a fake number. It's something that I've built over the time, over a span of 
almost three years and I feel like I should can keep doing this. I don't want to give up yet because I do really want to work on myself as well as a person. I want to lose this fat, honestly. Uh, I'm not proud of the shape of my body. Uh, I feel I can be, I can improve more as a person. I can improve more as a YouTuber and with my knowledge as well with the grades. So next year is all about the improvement. So that's or in development that's what i think uh the next year is going to be for development and improvement so 2020 is the year for improvement for making things better than it is right now and to bring out the maximum out there so 2020 the year of improvement let's go but with this note i'm gonna end it here the video is already too long Thank you so very much for supporting this channel, for being a lad, for being a subscriber, for being a part of this community. Even for watching but not subscribing still matters. I know that a huge, huge, huge percentage of people watch the channel but did not subscribe. And I'm not gonna procrastinate up towards this. I'm just gonna say thank you for watching, for having the time to be on this channel and i hope to see you in 2020 uh, and let's hope that Kappa won't destroy us all <laughs> thank you for watching and as always lads remember be cool stay awesome i'll see you tomorrow and i'll see you probably in the next decade 2020 i'm not sure if i'll make a video tomorrow but this is the video i want to say goodbye and to you, Skytree, from the future, as if you're watching this video right now. One year! I hope, I hope that you can reach... I guess I'd say 70,000, right? Can you reach 70,000, Sky? Can you still... Will you still be able to graduate or become to the... Th you should be a third year student by now, right? If you're watching this video. So, message to you, future Skytree. Keep doing what you do, don't give up, depression can hit you hard, uh, you can be alone for many years, you can though you, you're, even though you're alone, you're away from parents, you don't have friends, you don't have a girlfriend, you have to keep on doing this and stay strong, and keep on uploading no matter what, as Casey Neistat once told you, just keep uploading no matter what. Because I started for a reason, Sky. And if you're given, if you're gonna give up right now or next year, then what was the point of doing all of this, right? Stay awesome, and you too, Sky from the future.